Thanks, Aaron. It's now 816. TSU is showcasing several forms of green technology today at the 2013 Small Farm Expo. It's cutting costs on production, but who is saving money? Fox 17's Megan O'Halloran is live from TSU talking with the experts this morning. Megan. Well, I'm with Chandra Reddy from TSU this morning. Huge break for farmers. You guys are showcasing a lot of green technology. How is this helping everybody here? Oh, it helps the farmers. Of course, eventually it helps the consumer in terms of the quality, in terms of the cost, and in terms of the convenience. Some okay. of the technologies we are promoting, uh, the, the apartment dwellers or the home um, dwellers can grow uh, vegetables in there uh, hydroponically. In, inside their patios, inside their houses. We have video of that we showed you earlier in our 7 o'clock hour. The hydroponic farming down to the biofuel processing unit. When will we be seeing these savings show up in the grocery store for consumers? Eventually, it takes time. The, the big thing is, as I said, the cost savings in the grocery store plus the quality of the air and the uh, less greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. That, Saying that, that it's healthier. Yeah, it's healthier, yes. That's the biggest part of all these green technologies, that we all will have a better quality of life and then cost savings. The green farming is becoming the new wave of the future, cutting costs for farmers and eventually cutting costs for us, the consumers. You can check this all out at the 2013 Small Farm Expo right here at TSU. It's just getting started right now as we speak and runs until 3 o'clock today. We're live from TSU. Megan O'Halloran, Fox 17.